Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on June 5th, 2022. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet. A quick space weather update for you here. Looking at the last 48 hours on our sun, we did have quite the plasma filament eruption taking off from the northwest region of our sun and then from the southeast region of our sun. So antipodal reaction going on right now, large plasma filaments, and it's going back and forth with this large sunspot coming around and three sunspots in a triangulated position here in the southeast region. But this is the spot I was talking about. Watch for this large plasma filament, almost like the same one that last I showed last week, kind of looked like a hand reaching out. So large stream of plasma stretching from the surface of the sun. Very visible here, 304 angstroms. Pretty complex sunspot region coming in. Plasma filaments still stretched across the northern hemisphere and the southern hemisphere right now. And we're seeing them rip away and really dance around right now, the heliosphere of our sun. So heads up, everybody. And we are still affecting, or sorry, we are still waiting for the effects of the CME and solar flare from the other day. Amazing imagery here from Solar Dynamics Observatory. This is the antipodal reaction going on. Solar Cycle 25 has put on quite a show already, and we're going through a lull right now and have been for about a few days, but we're still on the verge of a possible geomagnetic storm, a G1, as we had an accelerated CME on its way to Earth, and just recently we had a solar flare, C-class solar flare, take off from the sun, not in an Earth-facing direction due to possibly give us a glancing blow. Stay tuned for the Daily Do that will be coming tomorrow for full world update. But I wanted to give you guys a quick space weather update and I want to give a thank you to everybody who is watching. I want to give a thank you to all of the memberships helping support and further research and development here with Daily Events Worldwide quick look here at the triangulated sunspot grouping I was talking about in the southeast region of our sun. Amazing stuff and amazing viewers. So thank you so much for inviting me into your living room. Solar X-ray Flux is in B range after jumping up to almost, well, a small C-class flare. And it is visible here on Lasco 2. A lot of backside action and as well, cresting. Now this is the last 24 hours of imagery. Sorry about that quick flash there. That is part of the animation. But I wanted to show you exactly what that flash was. I've seen it every so often. I'm not really sure what it's all about. It's almost like an inverted view maybe a calibration setting going on with Solar Dynamics Observatory. But nonetheless, this interesting picture shows up. Thanks for watching today. This was your space weather update for June 5th, 2022. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your daily due. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.